Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will tell you how to create a programmatic button in Swift. In case you are new here, hi, I am Jawad Balrami and I have been pursuing my career as an iOS developer for the past five years. So now without wasting any time, let's jump into our Xcode. Let's open Spotlight and write Xcode. So after opening Xcode, click on create a new Xcode project. After that, select apps and then click next. Now write your project name. I will write button and for now I would select team as a none and choose interface builder as a story port and language would be Swift. Now I will click next and I will save my files on desktop and just press create. After that you will see this layout and we finally create a blank project with empty view controller. So let's go to its Swift file which is view controller. Let me rescale it a little bit. And as you can see, our main controller is also empty. So now head back to view controller. We will write our code in view did load function. So now we will create a button instance by writing let button is equal to UI button. And kindly make sure that you have imported UI kit. Otherwise it will give us an error. Now we have to set an title and background color. So for that we will write button dot set title and we will have some option here just enter and we will write it here button dot normal to change the background color of the button we will use background color property so i will write button dot background color is equal to dot system red also we have to add sub view so that it will show on our app so we will write view dot add sub view button now if i try it on simulator it will not show anything because i haven't set its frame so as you can see there is nothing to be displayed on your app so now we will add button dot frame is equal to cg rect and now you will see different option we will select x y fit height option the x and y decides from your top left corner of the screen let's just say that we will place it at 100 and y axis on 200 and we will give width as 100 and height as a 50 and we will check either it places the button in the middle of the app let's just say that we are just doing a hit and trial method here also its corner are not rounded so for that let's use layer property to set the corner radius button so we will write button dot layer dot corner radius is equal to 25 as i have selected the value of height as 50 so for proper rounded shape i have to select half of its value so let's just start simulator and see the output. So as you can see 100 from the x axis and 200 from y axis. Now if I change the value of x from 150 and y 300 then it will show here. But as you can see that if we click the button it is doing nothing. So now we have to make it an actionable button. So let's add button dot add target. Button dot add target. We will write it here as self basically the self provides the instance of the view controller and in action we will write as selector which takes objective c method so let's create an objective c method by writing objective func button pressed and now just copy this function name and paste it here and for the event we will write touch up inside because when we press on button and raise our finger then this action happens so when we press our button on screen then this code will run you can write anything like just uh, printing out uh, button press in debug console like this print button is pressed also we can add to change parent view controller background color by writing view dot background color is equal to system blue so now when we run our app we can see that button is working properly and is doing its action. You can see here in debug console and in the simulator as well. So this is how we create programmatic button in Swift. If this video is helpful for you, then kindly hit that like button and smash that subscribe button so that you will not miss any video. I will see you in next video. Till then, goodbye.